What is going on guys? It's Caleb here. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video guys, I'm going to take you guys through three properties that are under $300,000 here in Central Florida. You have to go a little bit further out. You have to go to Polk County to really find these houses that are move-in ready for under $300,000. Polk County is actually located between Tampa and Orlando. It's a great county to live in. You can find a lot of good communities, a lot of nice subdivisions. So without further ado, let's get into the video. All right guys, so this first property on the list is located in North Lakeland. And this subdivision it's actually in is Foxwood subdivision. It's a really, really nice subdivision. Um, you have zero HOA. As you can see, it has a really, really nice size front yard. The lot size is actually 0 0.30. Um, this home was actually built in 1984. It's been completely renovated and um, it features three bedrooms. It has two full baths. It's actually only 1,275 square feet of interior space, but um, it's been completely renovated, like I said. It looks absolutely amazing. So um, I'm excited to show you guys this property. The annual taxes are $2,405 a year, and it is currently on the market for $300,000. So let's go take a quick look. Beautiful landscaping. And it just has great curb appeal. So um, let's go ahead and take a quick tour. I do like the fact that they did stage the property so you can get an idea of, you know, kind of how your furniture would look. So um, as we go ahead and enter the home, you go right into the living room. You have beautiful tile flooring. And then as we go to the left-hand side, we'll find the dining room. And uh, just right behind that is the kitchen. Obviously, it's a brand new kitchen. You have uh, granite countertops, white wood cabinets, stainless steel appliances. This home is completely ready to go, move in ready. Um, there's a look at the sink. You got your dishwasher, your fridge. And I haven't actually seen this in any house is the sliding glass door that's just right off of the um, the kitchen. I kind of like it though. Um, it's definitely not bad. Um, it has a pretty good sized backyard as well, which we will get to here shortly. But um, just right through this door here, we have the garage access, just a regular, you know, standard two car garage. And as we continue, guys, we'll find the primary bedroom, which is just right here to the left hand side. And it's actually a pretty good sized bedroom. So I think this home would be great for, you know, a starter home or just somebody looking to downsize or just want something affordable, um, especially with interest rates being the way they are. Anyways, there's a look at the two closets and um, the bathroom is just right here. You do only have one sink, sink and vanity. You get your toilet and then shower tub combo. Looks like you have some jets, so that's nice. But uh, as you can see, very, very nice bathroom. And um, we'll just go ahead and go to the other side, which is, as you can see, it's a split floor plan. And then we'll go ahead and go out to the back of the house and show you the backyard. But here is our second full bath, really, really nice bathroom. And then we have bedroom number two, just right here. I do love the windows as well. Um, I believe they have installed new windows, so really, really nice. And there's a look at the closet. Go right into bedroom number three, which is pretty identical to bedroom number two, but they're both really good sized bedrooms. Considering this house is under 1300 square feet, um, bedroom sizes are pretty good. So there's a look at the closet. And lastly, guys, we'll just go out to the back of the house show you guys the backyard. You do have a nice lanai, which uh, I think is a really, really nice thing. You got uh, brand new screen, brand new paint. Look at it. It's absolutely gorgeous. Great, great space here just to kind of hang out. Oh, there goes the AC unit. But uh, anyways, I'll show you the backyard real quick. Got a little dog barking. So here's a look at the backyard. 
and uh, as you can see it's a pretty good size so and then it goes all the way to uh, to that fence there so it is fully fenced except for just that side over there but overall guys great house three hundred thousand dollars move in ready um, here in a great subdivision in North Lakeland so there is good properties in this price point obviously so let's go ahead thank you guys for watching and we'll see you at the next house all right guys our next home in today's video is located in Kissimmee Florida as you can see it has a pretty nice sized front yard a decent sized driveway this one is actually a pool home so I was able to find a pool home and I'm pretty excited because I feel like they are gonna, going to start hitting the market again soon for those of you who are looking for pool homes in the low 300s. Um, this home actually features three bedrooms. It has two full baths. Um, it has a little under 1,200 square feet of interior space. It's on a 0 0.19 acre lot. You have annual taxes of $2,320 a year. A monthly HOA of $82 a month and it is currently on the market guys for $300,000 even so let's go ahead and take a quick tour of this home all right so right when we get in we have the kitchen which is just directly to the right hand side um, I did notice it did not have a dishwasher, but overall, I mean, other than that, it has everything you need. You have wood cabinets, granite countertops to look at your stove, and then you have the sink right there. Um, just right next to it is the entry and exit to the two-car garage. Tile flooring all throughout, brand new interior paint. As we move forward, we'll go right into the living room space. You have the primary bedroom just right over there through that door. But we'll go ahead and start the tour to the left-hand side. And we'll find <clears throat> bedroom number one. Got brand new carpet in the bedrooms as well. Give you a quick look at the closet. Pretty decent sized closet. And we have our first full bath, sink and vanity, shower tub combo, and then we'll find bedroom number two. Oh, again, good size walk in closet. And then we'll just go ahead and make our way to the opposite side of the house and we will find the primary suite. You have the double doors that lead out to the backyard, which we'll get to here shortly. But um, for this size of a house, the bedrooms are actually, are actually pretty good size. So look at the bathroom, one sink and vanity, and then your walk-in shower. So look at the closet, decent sized closet. I mean, you can't expect too much right now at this price point um, as far as square feet but I do believe the market will get better as uh, we continue for buyers at lower price points so anyways now that we've reached the backyard fully fenced as you can see could use some landscaping uh, looks like it hasn't been touched up in a while but we do have a pool guys we have a nice undercover lanai um, we do have a pool I would say the only thing I would suggest is just to put a screen around it. Uh, that's that's what I would do in my opinion. But overall, I mean, it has has a lot of potential to be a great property for someone um, who is on you know this side of the price scale. So, anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed this tour, and uh, we'll see you at the next property. All right, guys. So the next home in today's video will be a townhome. We're actually here in Lakeland, Florida. And the reason I brought you guys here is because this townhome is in a wonderful community of Chelsea Oaks. It's fully gated. As you can see, I'm gonna give you a quick look at the, uh, the street view and just the surrounding area that I'm currently in. Um, it's very, very spacious. It features 1,953 square feet of interior space. It was built in 2008, so it's not too old of a property. You have annual taxes of $2,143 a year 
and uh, it features three bedrooms. You have two full, then you have one half bath, and it is currently on the market for $295,000. So let's go ahead and take a quick tour. All right, guys, so as we get in, you have uh, brand new interior paint. You have brand new tile flooring as well. So as we move forward, we'll actually find the half bath just right here. So here's a quick look at that. And um, as we move forward to the right hand side of me, we have the uh, garage access just right through this door. There's a look at the two car garage space. Uh, to the right hand side, we also have these stairs that will lead up to the second level, but we'll get to that here shortly. But first we'll go ahead and go right into the living room space. Got pretty high ceilings, good light. And to the right hand side, you'll see the dining room space. There's a look at the sliding glass doors. You have no rear neighbors, so I think that's a good feature to have. And uh, we'll just go ahead and continue right and go right into the kitchen, which is a very good sized kitchen. You don't have any fancy countertops or appliances or anything like that. But as you can see, guys, it's very, very clean. There's a look at the sink, you get your dishwasher, refrigerator, and then just directly behind me, you have the microwave and oven. A pretty good amount of cabinet space as well. Let's go ahead and open this up. I believe this is the pantry. So there's a look at the pantry. And that will conclude the, the first level. So let's go ahead and go upstairs. I'm excited to show you guys the uh, remaining bedrooms and bathrooms. So you don't have any carpet anywhere in this townhome. So you don't have to worry about that. And it's completely moving ready. So I think it's, uh, it's not a bad deal at all. But uh, anyways, Here's a look at bedroom number one, and as you can see, guys, look how big these bedrooms are. Very, very nice bedroom sizes. So look at the closet. Then I believe you have more closet space. Yes, yeah, so you have more closet space just right over here. Look at that little area right there. And uh, we have our first full bath, just right here to the left-hand side. Shower tub combo, very, very clean uh, bathroom. Then as we continue, go down the hall to the right-hand side, we'll find the laundry room. Pretty good sized laundry room. I think you have the water heater. Yeah, so you have the water heater just right there as well. And uh, we'll go to bedroom number two. And uh, again, very, very nice size bedroom. Got a walk-in closet in this one. All right, nice size little closet. And then just to the opposite side, guys, we'll have the primary suite, which, so look at the space there. Show you guys the uh, primary bath. We got the double sinks, which is a plus. Um, there's a look at the Closet, really, really nice soaker tub. I was a little bit disappointed with the walk-in shower. It just seems a little narrow and small. I would have expected it to be a little bit more spacious, but I think they use a lot of that room for this soaker tub right here, which is really nice soaker tub. But overall, guys, hope this gave you a good idea of uh, what's available for under you know $300,000. And I thought I'd include a townhome just for those of you that are interested so anyways guys that will be it for this tour and i hope you enjoyed all right guys that will be it for today's video i hope you enjoyed it i put a lot of time in these videos so if you could please hit the thumbs up i would greatly appreciate that don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you guys in the next video